Hi guys, it's me once again, and this is going to be kind of like a blast from my past DVD edition. So pretty much, I am just want to show you a couple of DVDs of like shows and movies and stuff that I used to enjoy way back in the day. And I'm not going to be able to tell you like the years on this stuff. You just have to like bear with me, okay? Because some of it could range from when I was like 10 to like 16, 17. I don't really know. So just bear with me if you will. Also, I know the lighting is terrible. I'm sorry. I also know that the camera is really bad too. Once again, I am sorry. I'm just trying to make some content that you might find entertaining. So... Let's jump right into it. First and foremost, I need to knock this out of the ballpark. Uh, if you watched my last Blast From My Past video, you already know this is coming. So, I have a Hannah Montana DVD. This is called One in a Million. It is the one with the Jonas Brothers on it. I know, judge me all you want. So, used to be a with him Montana and the Jonas Brothers so I'm actually gonna pull from this pile now and I'm gonna show you a this is High School Musical and it says it's remixed I used to love this movie and it's like two discs so that's kinda neat I'm not gonna tell anyone like the premise of these I guess DVDs because like you just have to go look this stuff up. This is actually pretty good. So, if you want to check that out, that's totally cool. And this is a That's So Ravens. It says Ravens House Party. So, I really liked That's So Raven. I thought that it just kind of... It just basically, like... It showed... Um kids that it's okay to be different or to like want to become a model or like a fashion designer or whatever it was it was just really refreshing to see something like that out there and I really hope that there are shows out there for this generation that they can enjoy them like that um, I have another Disney DVD this is That's So Sweet Life of Hannah Montana my aunt was really cool uh, back in the day, my aunt would, um, give me and my siblings, like, DVDs and stuff. And all of these DVDs right here that I just showed you, just got through showing you, the Hannah Montana's, the, all of these right here was given to me by her. So, she was really cool. Shout out to her. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, I liked a lot of Disney stuff back in the day because I thought Disney Channel was pretty good back then. And I wish they would bring some of their older stuff back. Which I know occasionally they might play it at night or they might play it on their channel. But, I guess I don't pay attention, do I? So, um, anyway, this is Naruto Shippleton. So, pretty much, it's just four episodes. I didn't pay hardly anything for this. I cannot even remember how much I paid for this. And yes, I bought it myself. There's the inside of it. Uh, if you know me on a personal level, you already know that I love Naruto. Like, you already know this. But if you don't know me on a personal level, yes, I really enjoy uh, Naruto. I really enjoy anime in general. Obviously, that's what the channel name is about. You know? Um, I still love the show to this day. I just wanted to kind of show you guys this. So, I actually went and I bought an Adventure Time DVD. It's the complete first season. And this is really cool because there's like a commentary thing. But, wait. I have to show you the disc in this thing. Okay, so first what you'll do is you take off Finn's hat and it's like his hair. And it gets up so much better, I promise. And then when you open it up, it's like a little 
skin thing. And then here's like a skeleton. But hold on. And there's his brain. I don't know. I love this stuff. It's really cool. It's very artsy. So if you like kind of artsy, a little bit trippy shows, Adventure Time is probably the one for you. Alright. So now we're going to get into a couple of DVDs that like I am not entirely uh, enthusiastic about buying, but you know what? When you get into a fandom, you get into a fandom. You do not play around. Alrighty. Here we go. I have the first Twilight movie. This pretty much goes without saying. Once again, everybody was obsessed with this movie back in the day and the book. So, if you've not read it, you should probably read the book. It's... A, it's a little bit better than these movies honestly a little bit better more detailed um the movies aren't terrible like i've seen some really bad movies in my time <laughs> like i've seen some really bad ones but these aren't that bad so i have eclipse and i don't like have new moon i don't understand i just do might and i have breaking dawn part one and i didn't buy the second one so, I don't have the second one. And then, just to kind of add to the Disney Channel obsession, I have another Hannah Montana DVD. And I believe this is, it says it's season one. And it's got four discs in it. And for some odd reason, I cannot get this out. Anyway, so... Apparently, I have all of season one, so that's pretty cool. Um, I do want to bring it back a little bit to these Twilight DVDs. I do want to say that these, um, the series is not, <coughs> sorry, that's gross. Anyway, the series is not, like, absolutely terrible. I've, um, watched the movies that absolutely destroy, um, franchises and, these are not that bad, honestly, they're not. Um, I mean, I thought they were pretty good for, like, the time that they came out. And, um, honestly, if you want to have something to kind of watch, like, binge watch, I guess, these would probably be the thing that you could, like, check out. Um, I'm not 110 in this fandom so much, like, now that I've gotten a little bit older, but... It is a pretty cool uh, little series. So, when I was like 13, 14, 15, you know, it was, it was the series, man. It was something. So, I'm going to show you one more thing. And then I'm going to have another video with some DVDs that are like stuff that I like currently that I think you should watch so yeah let me just show you this very quickly how cool is this Avatar The Last Airbender says it's book 3 uh, Fire and it says volume 1 so I have not watched this in a very long time but I used to love Avatar so it kind of reminds me of an anime I don't really know uh, if you consider this an anime, considering it was like American, you know, Nickelodeon, whatever. But, um, it gave me anime vibes and I really enjoyed it. It was around the time I was getting into like Naruto and all that jazz and just thought it was really cool. Um, so yeah, thanks a whole lot for watching this video. If you want to hear some more about... Uh, DVDs or if you want to like talk about music or anything you know movies TV shows whatever leave me a comment down below which DVD was your favorite or which show did you like when you were younger that you have a DVD of or VHS tape that'd be cool either one uh, let's talk about that a little bit you know, why not? Um, 
if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and also please subscribe to my channel I post videos every Saturday I don't have a time for it right now I'm sorry I'm very bad at keeping up stuff so just keep checking the channel out on Saturday and I'll definitely have something up um, yeah sorry that I'm kind of bad for that but um thanks for watching please check out some of my other videos if you would like to they're pretty entertaining and i will see you guys later bye